Welcome back to my channel. Today I have a super exciting video and uh, it's a thrift haul, but it's a super colorful rainbow thrift haul. And this is all the clothes I have. There's some really cute stuff. I'll also eventually do a neutral thrift haul because I also have quite a bit of neutral pieces, but I thought it'd be fun to switch them up like this, like have a very colorful one and then a very neutral one. Um, because yeah, that's two different parts of like my style. Funnily enough, I'm actually wearing a very neutral outfit for this video. But yeah, let's just get into it. I think I'm just gonna follow the rainbow like this. Uh, so yeah, let's just get into the first piece. The first piece is these really cute shorts and I actually got this in like a little bundle from Vinted. I got three different items, um, like a bundle deal as in uh, a discount deal, not a, a surprise like bundle, um, style bundle or anything. But I saw these shorts and I really was looking for some shorts that I'd like. And I saw these fuzzy shorts and I just kind of fell in love. And they're so cute and they remind me of the Lorax, but purple. Um, so yeah, I really, really like these. And I think they're originally from Zara. The tag is kind of like disheveled, but it looks like a Zara tag. And that's what the seller said as well. And I got this in a bundle deal with two other items. One that I'll be showing here and another one that I'll show somewhere else. And the total was like eight euros without shipping. So I think these shorts were probably the most expensive thing. I think these were probably like three or four. I think these were four euros. But yeah, they're really cute. Um, and yeah, I love them a lot. The next item is this super amazing button up. I love this one so much. It has this beautiful rainbow stripe. Like there's two blue stripes, a yellow, a dark pink and a light pink. And I love the contrasted like striping that goes a horizontal and then the rest goes vertical. Uh, that doesn't continue on the back, that's just on the front, but it's such a nice button up. Um, and it's from the brand um, EDC. I've never heard of this brand and it's so nice and I love it a lot. And I think this button up was sport euros. This is another item from Vinted and I got this in a little bundle actually um, with the items I'll show you next and another item that will be in my neutral video because it's a neutral color. And I think um, it's actually uh, from Shein I saw, um, which I would not buy Shein new ever. Um, I don't buy fast fashion at all, but I would definitely not buy Shein. But secondhand, I'm totally fine with it. I don't remember how much it was. I think it was like four or five. I'm really not sure anymore. Uh, it was a little bit ago. And yeah, I love bell sleeve things. I just thought it was really cute. Then the thing I actually was like going to the seller for um, was a bathing suit because I saw that she had a bathing suit and it was originally from Shein. But yeah, I found this bathing suit and I thought it was a really cute print and I wasn't, I was looking for bathing suits because um, my bathing suits don't really fit me anymore and I had gotten one and uh, that fits me now but I wanted another one and a fun and colorful one. And I found this one and yeah, it's really cute. It's just a simple tie bikini. And yeah, these are the bottoms. Really cute print. I'm not trying this on in the video because I don't feel comfortable doing that on the internet. But yeah, you kind of get the idea. And it also came with this little like overskirt thing that's incredibly impractical. And I didn't really need. I was fine with just the bathing suit, but that was like included um, with it. And it's this little skirt thing and I did not think this was going to fit but miraculously um, with a lot of like shimmying I got it on um, but yeah it's cute and yeah I'm really still happy with this and I'm glad that I found another bathing suit and I'm excited to wear this like swimming too and I think the bathing suit set was about around 10 euros I'm not really sure um, but I thought that was a decent deal on Vinted so yeah I'm really happy with it the next piece is this super cute sweater vest and it's from a brand called Blue Mod since 1966 and it's this really like long um, sweater vest and it's super soft and I saw this and I really wanted uh, another sweater vest. I've always really liked sweater vests. I have one uh, like a tight fitted black glittery one but I really wanted a fun more like colorful one uh, that I could wear more like in summer. Um, and I saw at a thrift store they had some, but some were uh, wool, which I can't wear because I'm super allergic. Um, but this one is acrylic, so I can wear this one. And they also had a purple one that was so cute but had a stain on it, and I wasn't, 
I was like, mm, I'm not going to do that because they were like 10 euros. This was 10 euros, by the way. So I was like, I'm not going to pay 10 euros for something that has a stain on it. But this one didn't have any stains and I thought it was so cute. And I really wanted a green one, so it worked out really well. Then I got this insanely beautiful uh, slip dress. I got this at the same store as I got the sweater vest. And it was also 10 euros. And it's so beautiful. It has these like orange roses on it. And it has two layers, this like mesh uh, printed layer and then this like satiny layer. And it like splits open here, which I think is so pretty. It has these little strings as well. And yeah, it's just straight across back. And it has this really cute ruffle edge on the bottom that the uh, printed layer is actually shorter than the under layer. And I think it's so pretty. Uh, I put it on and I was just like, whoa. Um, it's it's so nice and this is originally from uh, say and ah then this is probably one of my favorite pieces i've gotten like ever um it's a handmade robe i got it at a second hand store but i think somebody made this themselves um and yeah it's this really beautiful yellow with these pink flowers it has this really cool like detail on the cuff um it's kind of like a robe but it's also like a dress because it has like a little um, closing thing here with like a button and then it has like a tie to wrap it more around um, so it actually like closes kind of like a dress you probably would want to wear something under it um, but yeah it has one little pocket here too and I just thought it was so cute it was 20 euros which is more than I usually spend in a thrift store but I was like I've spent more like online thrift stores on one item sometimes and I was like, this is a handmade piece, and I put it on and it fit me so well, and I just was like, wow, I am taking this home. And I just thought the colors were perfect, I'm loving purple, I've always loved yellow, and I've always loved pink. So, yeah, I just thought it was so pretty, it's very long, um, and I love it so much. Now we're into the pink section, and I actually got a lot of pink clothes, and here's one of the um, first things. I got this little skirt at a thrift store for two euros and yeah it's just a really simple skirt it has no tag in it it feels kind of like a swimsuit material um so either it's a swimsuit skirt or it's from a really like crappy fast fashion brand and that's just the material i thought was appropriate for a skirt um but yeah i just thought it was really cute and i actually liked it because it was kind of cool and i thought it would be handy for like the beach or like by the pool or something or um anywhere where you go swimming and I thought the print was really cute and I love the orange and pink and like the reddish orange. I just think red and pink is a really cute combination that I used to love to wear when I was a kid. Um, so yeah, and I just thought the skirt was really cute. It is a little long in the back so I'm considering cut like making it a little shorter in the back so it's more like this instead of this. But I'm not sure yet so I'm thinking about that but yeah, I like it a lot. Then this piece is probably the least summery piece I got um, but it's these like hot pink uh, sweatpants and they're like a culotte style um, but they're sweatpant material and I got these on Vinted as well they are originally from Zara but yeah it has a little like pocket here in the back and it's really cute the waistband is so nice and it's so comfortable and I actually wore it with this sweater and a white top I have um, with like um, a little pirate fairy lady on it and I loved it so much and yeah I just think it's a really cool pair of pants and yeah I think they're super comfortable and they were eight euros the next pink piece I got is this a dress that I got at another thrift store um, yeah, Mark Tram. I got a few of these pieces there and it's um, a thrift store that I go to quite a bit and funny enough this dress is also originally from Zara I got a lot of secondhand Zara pieces this time and this dress I think was two euros I think it was originally five but they priced it down to two and it's this like midi to yeah kind of like a midi to maxi length and it's really cute and that I got it for two euros makes it even cooler and I think this color is so pretty I love this this color pink I think it's very happy and I love it a lot then I got these super cute shorts, and they have uh, hibiscus flowers on them, um, small and large, like overlaid, and I think this is such a cute pair of shorts, and I actually got these, and they didn't fit me, even though they, they're a 38, which generally I am a 38, 
but they're a French brand and French brands tend to be smaller than like Dutch or like the US sizes. So I got um, the lady who uh, tailors her clothes sometimes, she's super nice to um, add a little bit in the sides. It looks like a skirt by the way, um, like it has like a skirt overlay, um, but it has uh, shorts on the inside. It's a really cute pair of shorts and I got this, I think it was also four euros, but to alter it because it was like hard to take all the things out and add the uh, extra slits in the um, the extra fabric in the skirt and the shorts. I think I paid $16.50 for alterations, so these shorts ended up being around $20. Um, but I still think they're really cute. I'm, I'm lucky that I got such a steal on Vinted um, so that I could like pay for the alterations still. And I think they're a really cool pattern. This is the brand of the shorts. The next top I actually got in a bundle with these purple shorts and another top that will be in my neutral thrift haul. And this was also very affordable. I think it was two or three euros. And it's this really cute top. And you're supposed to wear it, I think, with this up. But because of the elastic um, in the like arms being very tight, um, I can only wear it like this. So if I want to wear it like with it, the straps just facing upwards, I'm going to have to uh, replace the elastic. Um, but for now, I actually kind of like how it looks like this as well. And this is the brand. It says Coat Femme. Sorry if I messed up the pronunciation, but um, I think it's a really cute top and yeah, I think it's really nice. The fabric is kind of funny. It's again like kind of like a bathing suit kind of feeling. It feels like kind of nice, but also kind of like a bathing suit, but I think it's really pretty. Um, so yeah, then this is the last clothing piece and then I have one more pair of shoes that I also want to show you guys. But this dress I found at a vintage store and it was super curated, super well taken care of. Everything was so nice. And this dress is so pretty. Um, I found another dress that's actually similar to the dress I'm wearing. And I love the dress I'm wearing. It's my favorite dress in the whole world. So um, I thought to try that on, but it was just like two or three sizes too large. So I wasn't gonna get it because it didn't fit me. And I would, would need a lot of alterations and then I would be taking something away from somebody who would actually fit that dress perfectly. Um, so yeah, um, but then my mom found this dress and gave it to me and I was like, do you wanna try this on? And I was like, yeah, it's super pretty. And I tried it on, it fits me like perfectly and I felt like some kind of Disney princess. So it was like the best feeling ever. Um, and yeah, it has this really pretty detailing here and it has a zipper. It is a little see-through in the skirt. The top isn't see-through, but the skirt is a little see-through. So probably need to wear something under it. Um, and it has like a zipper. It also has this little waist tie to tighten it more if you want to. And it's just so pretty and I love it so much. It was the most expensive thing in this uh, thrift haul. Um, it was 35 euros, but for a piece this special, I was totally willing to pay that and it's by this brand Mary Time, but I think it's so pretty and I love supporting small vintage stores as well. Um, so yeah, I love this dress a lot. Then the final piece of this thrift haul are a pair of shoes that I got at Yo Marks Come, a thrift store near me, and I saw them on an Instagram of a person who sells in that store uh, saying that they were gonna be sold and that they were 450, and I saw them and, and I raced to the store. Um, I had driving lessons in like 30 minutes, so I had to race there and then them back in the morning right when they opened. I wanted to make sure that nobody else had the shoes. Um, so yeah, I like cycled there so fast um, and I made it and yeah, and these are the shoes. And I've been wanting mules like this, exactly like this kind of mule with a nice square heel. Um, and like a little band like this and in a fun color or or white um, I have black enough black shoes and uh, I've worn them a couple times now so the soles are a little like uh, scuffed already but when I got them they were pretty much not worn that much um, there is a little like damage on here a little bit but you probably can't even see that and they're so pretty and I love this block heel and for 450 I thought it was such a steal and I'm super happy with these.
So yeah, that was the whole thrift haul. I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, please let me know what your favorite piece was. Um, I obviously love all of them. That's why I got them. And yeah, um, I think it's such a fun, colorful, like, colorful clothes. And I really am trying to find my own style now. And like a lot of these pieces really spoke to me and I've been really working on that and trying not to be influenced by trends as much and just really going with my gut. Um, so yeah, and I'm super happy with this. I also want to say this was collected over like a period of like three, three months probably. Um, so maybe even longer, maybe even four months. Um, but yeah, I am super excited about all these pieces and I'm really excited to wear them and some of them are already worn, but I'm uh, still so super excited about the ones I haven't worn yet. And yeah, I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you have a really great day and I hope to see you all in the next video. Bye guys.